Maggie. Where are we going today? Huh? Where are we going today? We gotta have some good boots. These are Danner boots, by the way. I don't know if you've ever had a pair. What's the name of that place? Duluth. Duluth. Trading or something. I'll get you a pair of Danners. I like them. I'm gonna head on out here in a minute and Maggie's not going. Maggie took a ride yesterday get her ear checked out and I think she thinks she's getting ready to go again today so ain't happening. Sorry Maggie. We're in Gold Hill, North Carolina today. Cute little town. Love it. Now that's cool. That is awesome. Old filling station. Baskets and gifts. We're going to go shopping while we're here. Uh oh. <laughs> There's, a here. There's the post grill. office. Look. Oh how precious. Love this. Look here. We're gonna come around through here and go see this old barn over here in the distance and try to circle around and check this out. What do you think? Yeah, I'm excited. I love the little town. And he dovetail notched. Very nice. Very nice. This is the way to go. Lean to's all the way around. Look how good a shape. Look, you need inside too. How cool. They got lights. That is so nice. Worth the trip already. Absolutely. Look at that feed trough. Wow. We'll get up there and check it out in a minute. Did you get in cold? Yes. And in the sun again. It feels good. It does. Look how tall that is. It's a very nice place. I want you to look at this feed trough right here. The history. I wonder how many animals have eaten this thing. We might eat our lunch out here. We might. <laughs> look how uh, they made this into a sink drain. I love it. Well, animals wore this down over time. It's just like um, for my or something. It's over 20 feet long. Yes. Right on it. Yeah, it's just all that stuff. Awesome shape. It really is. It's tall too. My cup of tea right here. I wonder if it's all original. Picnic tables. This walkway. Carved out. <laughs> For short folks. <laughs> but there's two open door picnic areas it's like they have lighting here look at that got these in the old cabin i could spend all day right here looking at this Man. that top log right there best i can tell here and I believe without a joint at all every bit of 40 foot long do not vandalize let's keep it natural so well preserved there's another picnic area in there little shoots where they could feed their animals back in the day yep and they could store their hay up there it used to just be a drive through with your wagon Stop right here and throw your hay up in the law. Hen hen, and this is a dovetail notch right here. Man, this is amazing, ain't it? Really it's beautiful. Prettiest, beautifulest one I've ever seen, I believe. It's huge. You didn't tell me about this, Billy. Surprise. Did you know this was here? Surprise. You surprised me. Yeah. No, you did not. Did you know it was here? I did. You knew this was here? Yeah, was you oh, you too <laughs> crazy. They do have a graffiti sign, Billy. Yeah, I think that's what I said. No, it wouldn't. Look at this millstone. Did you see that? That thing is cupped out. Check that out. And it is huge. You can't see the magnitude of this, but 
Just dished out smooth. Here's the old bolts. Things like six foot across. And the backside just looked like a rock. And that's where they ground it out of that single this big rock huge wall. Stone. It was built in the 1840s or something like that. This is another one of them big millstones that got busted up. That rock wall. We'll go across the street in a minute. Oh, a little bitty miniature grinding wheel here. The 19th century view from the Miller shaft. First gold discovery in Gold Hill was on the farm of Andrew Troutman in 1824. The small family operation utilized a Chilean ore mill to grind the gold laden ore into fine powder. The mill was turned by use of horse or mule power. This mill is believed to be the only original complete working mill with all its original gears remaining from the 19th century mining era in North Carolina. It was originally owned and operated by the Schaefer family at Gold Hill, North Carolina. Overview of the Gold Hill Mine, Barnhart Shaft, Smelter, and Ean Stamp Mill. Photo was taken circa 1880. The head frame of the Barnhart Shaft is pictured in the distance near the center of the photo between the smelter on the right and the stamp mill on the left. The shaft can be seen today and is located just beyond the amphitheater stage in the chain link fence. Further in the distance is Main Street, now St. Stephen's Church Road in the village of Gold Hill. Barnhart Mine was dug in 18, September 1842. Colonial... <laughs> yeah, cut that. George Barnhart was the son-in-law of John Reed of Gold, Reed Gold Mine, now a North Carolina State Historical Site. Log rockers were used at Gold Hill from 1824 to 1900. Much of the above ground task or gold ore processing fell to the women and children while their husbands and older sons worked underground to bring up the ore. The women and younger children worked the crushed ore using the lock rockers. Lock rockers. Log rockers. <laughs> Go I ahead. quit. The basin of the rockers held mercury, which would cling to the gold. All other material was washed away, usually after fall harvest. Many farmers would turn to digging for gold to supplement family income. Never give up, Billy. <laughs> I bet you Look, that. this must be the shaft don't drop your sunglasses down in there oh man i think i see gold down in there do you see that goodness i wish we could get down in there there's a hole right there down in there going that way ain't that something mm. that is so neat right there maybe we can see down in there Come on down. I wanted to make sure it was safe. It could have been a gremlin critter down here, here, a critter down here or something. Look at that. Oh my goodness. Oh my mercy, that's awesome. Could you imagine having to work and go through that tunnel? Wow. I hope y'all see that good. I'm so glad they put that up there like that so you could see the light come in. Mm -hmm. Well, I don't know how deep that goes. We should have brought a flashlight that was bright. Yeah. Mike could have seen up in there. Or better yet, you just come check it out. That's right. And then uh, it is worth the trip so far. This is cool in itself. Okay, now let's wow. go check this Yes, they have. Look how big they are. You can judge by Billy. You can see they're probably a good, almost six foot tall. Ain't that something? Look at them gears. Wow. Yeah, that's steel gears built on a wood platform. Well, I tell you what, you broke one of them. You better know how to pick some because I don't know where you're going to get one at. Yep. 
Yep. This is the one that we showed at the entrance up there. It's like the same style, but it's the piece that goes on the bottom and then the millstones yep, go up there. Edge. Oh man, that's smooth. <laughs> smooth as a what, Billy? Baby's bottom. A baby's butt. <laughs> baby's bottom or butt. Is the where you're from and how you want to say it. Yep. That's amazing. This must be how you turned it out here. Which I'm gonna assume worked off a steam engine, which there is on this property somewhere, I think across the street. I have to check that out also. Awesome. So I guess they used the rail, brought the carts out, drug them out through that tiny tunnel we just seen over there, and come up here and pulled that out of there, and then they'd crush that. Another one of the busted millstones. Those things are huge. Honey bees at work. Caution. They might be taking a break since it's winter time. Check out this jail. Cedar shake roof, shingles. Here's some of the water. Gold Hill Jail. I'll tell you what. I'll tell you what. It really is. Probably didn't want to come here because she's in jail. Guess somebody had a little bit too much fun at night. They put you in here to think about it. Can't believe you can't see in there, but try to get it in there. Hopefully that works right there. Do not know. I ain't seen me. Hey. There's Billy. <laughs> Look at the walkway. Go play on the slides and stuff. Get in there and do some dancing, Billy. Yeah, we could. That is one nice stage right there. No skateboards or rollerblades allowed on stage or patio. Thank you. Thank you very much. And graffiti. Do not do that. It's very mean. Really is. That is a awesome stage right there. I guess you set all the chairs out here. We gotta do a little performance real quick. I don't know what I would do. Would you like to do one? Okay, well, let's carry on. Uh, to be determined when we'll do an event here. I don't want to do it because I don't have permission. That's the only reason I ain't going to get up there and show my abilities right now. You got to have permission, Billy. Can't believe you was going to let me Sam do Frank Small, 1898 to 1988. Pretty good life right there. 90 years old. That's about how old grandpa was. And there's a millstone, little one, small one. This may be for grinding flour and wheat and corn. There's some good donating people around, folks. Love and remember Ryan Duran Turney. Live your best life. Ain't that something? It is some good words of advice. Is it? Let's keep it that way, Billy. That is awesome. That is clean. Being a bark. That is clean. I like it. Yeah. Gold Hill Mining District. Gold discovered here in 1824. Extensive mining begun in 1843, creating a booming town, copper mine, and district until 1907. It's the Gold Hill United Methodist Church. Check this out. It'll ring. <laughs> Keep trying, Billy. Don't give up. Let it work. Okay, now come back. Now let it go. Now come back. Okay, they get it. <laughs> Did you hear that? <laughs> that yes. is one big bell that's right amazing. there. I'm going to tell you that was amazing. Did you hear Billy trying to talk me out of doing that? The folks wanted to hear that bell, and I was able to do it. 
We're coming this way. We gotta see the steam engine. Look at this. This is a piece of a boiler to a steam engine back in here. I just heard an animal. Come out wherever you are. Maybe it wasn't. Look at the size of these rocks. Will you sit inside the grinding bowl? It's full of water. She is going to do it. I can't believe it. How about a pitcher right here? Man, that is a big one, ain't it? Gold mill, assay office, and ore shop. Eighteen twenty-four was the first gold discovery here. We can not see some old gold mining instruments, just some shifter. Look at the size of that. Yeah, had yeah, some big steel pipes holding that up. It's a big old bucket. Grinding stone. What is it? somebody made a little gold city look at that it's showing that is no metal detector pick shelves are prohibited be touching none of it you will be prosecuted, will be prosecuted. i don't blame you. i won't fall in an old mine staff this way yeah. Wow. That must be the shaft right there. Them rocks are. It must have went up through there. Hmm. I guess it's caved in over the years. Yeah, I guess the entrance was right there. And went up in there, you know. Randolph shaft. What do you think of that? In four years, was at that time four hundred thousand. Today it's eight million. But that is a big, big steam engine. This is a smaller one version. Look at that, dude. We can see up in this dude. Wow. Woo. Pretty big. That's like cut it out so you can see. You know they may just cut metal off to repair another one. I thought maybe they cut this out to show the what it was like inside. That may have been what they did. They may have uh, just needed metal. Looks like the Boy Scouts built this one. Aww. Caleb Watson, Troop 443 Eagle Project. Thank you very much there, Caleb. Nice fir tree right there. If you need a fence and you're in the Charlotte area, there's Wilson Fence Company. Just saying. That's a pretty deep one there, Billy. Yeah, I see that tree. I'm gonna go around here. I hope that's where you can see down in there. What we have to do. Oh, okay. Yeah, that's all. Stamp Mill Powder House. No vehicles behind it beyond here. Alright, let's go. Let's go. Come on. We're going together this time. Yeah. Yep. Going down to the powder house. This is where they kept all the explosives to blast all that stuff with. Mm -hmm. Go check it out. Down this path right here.
All right, we're coming up on the powder house. Yeah. Really is. If you come out here to Gold Hill, don't give up. Well, there was a little bit of a hike back in here to the powder house. Look at that thing. Make sure it ain't no critters in here. Might have been staying the night, you know what? <laughs> hey! 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 Get out! Look, that looks like gold in them brick up there. It's pretty neat. It really is. Look at that ceiling. That's awesome. It almost looks like these walls are caving in. They're kind of rounded. See the pretty brick up there? Yeah, it's nice brick. So this is the powder house. Powder house. Powder house. Storage for all the explosives. It is. It's shiny, ain't it? Yeah, it is. You see what I'm talking about? Oh, yeah. But then you can't see it when you get up to it. Now, when you back here, though, you can see it shining. I'm going to tell you what, right now, that looks like gold shining. It does. Not the camera oh, picks it up. Yeah. Seen it in a couple spots. Hello! Got a pretty good echo to it. I like it. Very pretty up here. Very cool. I'm gonna tell you what, where they've got it at. I guess I used to use this for wagon roads, I reckon, to get in and out of the mine. Well, there's the powder house. What's that down in there? So I guess we do need to crawl somewhere. Got old roofs. Look at that. It's pretty cute, ain't it? It is. Cute. There's outdoor dining too, look. Back home is open. Check it out. Wood-fired pizza. Cool. That's a cool sign. Look at this wall. come stay so look them up backstreet mercantile if you come to gold hill you can actually stay here it's like a bed and breakfast upstairs so see the golf, uh, oh man yeah that, awesome. that is awesome aero motor chicago see. right over top of the well house mm -hmm. i guess it looks like, yep. yeah it works see them arms going up and down mm -hmm. If you can see the rod going up and down, but it's a pump. It is working. Really nice. Some more chickens.
All right, we're in the general store out here in Gold Mill, Gold Hill, Gold Hill. And check out this stove right here. We've been keeping warm around this thing. I love the way this uh, pipe goes through here. This is to help heat the place a little better. They'd run long lines of pipe and that kind of disperses the heat out. I love these old rugs. Uh -oh, that might be gold in them bottles. Man, that's amazing, ain't it? it was bigger than shark was. Yeah. Times changed, didn't they? Thanks a bunch. Yeah. I like it. You enjoyed it. Is this the original counter? Yep. Wonder how much money rolled across this thing. Them I silver like dollars and <laughs> I'm telling yeah. you. Them old I silver coins. All the money. <laughs> they ain't no telling. <laughs> That'd yeah. probably be quite so a bit. This, hey, this store was built in 1840, so yeah. you can figure. That one was too over there. That's, that's, that's 180 two. years. This town went from the four-way stop here to the four-way stop up yonder. Gotcha. A mile. And now this is it, right? After the park, it kind of ends. Yeah. 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 It, yeah. Yeah. That's gold mine they dug is right up straight across over yonder behind that cyclone fence. It's a barn hard shaft. We appreciate you letting yes, us look. Yes, thank you for... Oh, thank you. you're welcome anytime. Yeah, Take we'll, care. We'll come back when the weather's perfect. Yeah, we'll come back. All right, babe. I guess we're going to get out of here. Come on, check out old Gold Hill, y'all, North Carolina. Cute little town. There's a lot of shops down behind here. They said that Flynn's Village Grill is some good eating. Old Texaco Station. It's an old historic town. Started in, back in the 1820s. Been a fun time today. There's some of the old pulleys is talking about. This used to be the grist mill right here and they're running his antique shop right now but been some nice folks around here to talk to today sure have enjoyed the visit y'all make it a point to come out here and check it out sometime if you get a chance and thank y'all for watching and putting up with my rambling because i like to ramble y'all have a good one <laughs>